pain, 10 is the worst pain and zero is no pain at all, where would you uh, put your, the number? Pradeep Neopani, a male nurse, is making the morning rounds at the Sacred Heart Community Health Center in McLennan. Here, 25% of the nurses are male. That's an anomaly. Pradeep says only 8% of his classmates were male. That's similar to the national average for nurses. 9% male, 91% female. Calcium carbonate is 500. Even though the number of male nurses practicing here is three times the national average, old stereotypes fade away very slowly. Like when the call button went off this morning from a patient who needed help. I showed up and then said, oh, I was hoping for the nurse. And I'm waiting for the nurse. Uh, you, you can go, right? You know, she said, no, no, I am the nurse. <laughs> I can do whatever you want me to do. I'm here to help you. And we have sometimes where the, in outpatients in particular, where they'll say, is, is he the doctor? <laughs> so, <laughs> so a little bit of stereotyping for sure happens. Jackie adds that many of the male patients feel more comfortable with the male nurse. As long as they know what they're doing, it doesn't matter to me. <laughs> One night at the dinner table, Pradeep discovered a 180 degree twist on the old stereotype when his four-year-old daughter asked him, Hey, uh, Daddy, uh, can, can girl be nurses? And that was a unique moment for us. We, we had a laughter, you know, she see me as a nurse, as a man, and then she was wondering if she, if she could be a nurse. As for physicians, the proportion of females practicing Canada has climbed dramatically, from 7% in 1970 to 42% today. So Pradeep's spouse, Dr. Karen Neopani, doesn't have to battle the same stereotypes. She practices at the Sunrise Medical Center in Peace River. The couple first met in Pradeep's native homeland of Nepal. Pradeep followed Karen back to Canada. Shortly after, he enrolled in the nursing program at Red Deer College. That eventually led him to McLennan. So McLennan is a hospital that welcomes the newcomers who wanted to start their career. They are willing to uh, teach people. McLennan's a great place to work and definitely we, um, we will accept you as, regardless if you're male or female. So. My back is cold. Back is cold, okay. Pradeep embraces the challenges of rural nursing. We don't have special unit here. It's a general nursing, so you see everybody. Yeah. So that's, what, that's actually very exciting because you get exposed to so many different things. Sometimes, things he learned growing up in Nepal help him as a rural nurse in Alberta. We had one new patient coming into the unit. Uh, he was anxious, he was distressed. He was a bit restless, so uh, I was trying to communicate with him, but I wasn't getting too far. And I found out he speak one of the ethnic language that I spoke. So I actually sat down with him and then talked to him in his own language. And then, uh, and then after, after a while, he was able to calm down himself, and that's, that was good for me. Pradeep is part of a growing trend toward more male nurses in Canada. Studies show the supply of male nurses grew four times as much as their female counterparts over the past five years. Mm -hmm.